Hi, my name is Maria Voronsova, or BAT. Thank you very much uh, to everybody today for attending this workshop. Um, today, we would like to ask for your opinions about what grass information does Madagascar need. So, the Madagascar Grass Project has been running for more than 10 years already. Um, on the slide here, you see pictures of endemic species of poaceae in Madagascar. Grasses which are found in Madagascar and nowhere else in the world. We think there are approximately 217 endemic species and a total of five and a half hundred different grass species on the island of Madagascar. The study of grasses is a little bit different from general botany and from the study of other plants because the critically important features of a grass are very small and the important features are hidden inside grass spikelets. This means that in order to really identify and in order to study the grass species, we must use a microscope and we must investigate the structure of very small grass parts in a lot of detail. This picture is an example of the study of a Madagascar endemic panicum, panicum in BTNC. And as you can see, the critical lemmas and paleas in the species are less than one millimeter long. They're very, very small. On this slide, I have collected um, the titles of different papers our group has published on the grasses of Madagascar. So we have been going through botanical diversity of grasses and revising which are the correct names. How do we name the species correctly? Which grasses are really present in Madagascar and how should they be distinguished from one another? The biggest achievement, I think, of our work on Madagascar grasses is the publication of the book you see on this slide. So in 2018, we have published the Identification Guide to Grasses and Bamboos in Madagascar. On every page of this book, there is a description of one genus, one group of grasses, and also we have included information on how to identify this group of grasses and how to distinguish it from others. After the completion of the generic guide to Madagascar grasses, we also produced a second book called the Madagascar Grass Atlas. The Grass Atlas is very simple and it's a summary of the information on where grass species grow on the island. So every species of grasses that we know has a published map in the atlas. The next stage of our work with Madagascar grasses is making our knowledge really useful to agricultural development in this country. At the top of the slide, you can see title of the paper published by Cedric Sulufundra Noatra, identifying different kinds of fire and grazing grasslands on the island. Um, a project we are running at the moment, funded by the Darwin Initiative, is seeking to change grazing regimes to promote species of grasses really necessary for cattle grazing and really beneficial for agriculture. So today we would like to ask all of you, what kind of information about grasses do you need to improve the development in Madagascar, improve agricultural capacity and move our knowledge forward? 
On the slide here, I have presented um, a very famous South African grass guide published a few years ago to show you an example of the kind of guide we may be able to prepare for Madagascar grasses. So in this book, there are distribution maps of the species, there are photographs of the whole grass, there are photographs of spikelets, and information is presented in many different classifications. Um, so the question is, would it be useful to produce a guide like this to the grasses of central Madagascar? Another possibility is illustrated in this slide here, and this is different kind of identification tools. Because for non-specialists, it's difficult to see the differences between grasses for the first time. So we have an opportunity to create different kinds of identification aids to help Malagasy botanists and Malagasy agricultural workers identify their species. Um, thank you very much. Um, I'm very happy to invite everybody here today to collaborate on this work with us. Thank you very much for listening. Goodbye.